Hi, fellow birdies. birdies, and welcome back to another edition of Songbird's Eating Show. In today's video, we are reviewing some more Bucky's products. Now, these are spicy salsas. Now, mm -hmm. when I first saw the salsas there, I was like, well, this is going to be pretty interesting. You know, it's like, I wanted to try them out. So, we have habanero pepper, Carolina Reaper, and what I'm scared of the most, ghost pepper. So, we're going to try these out and see how we can handle the spice. Are All you right. ready? I am. <laughs> Let's go. So what we're going to do is the least hot out of all these three. <laughs> this is um, habanero pepper. And let's just see how it is. Tortilla chips here. So, oh, I gotta hold my breath. Ready? Why don't you hold your breath? Well, I'm scared of spice, you know that. Here we go. Ooh. That's definitely spicy. I can feel it in my tongue. Ugh. Wow, it's got quite a kick. Ooh. And this is not even the hottest one. Mm -hmm. This is really making me scared of trying those other two. But that heat definitely comes to you right away after the first bite. Like, ugh. So, that for me, like, let's just like rate, rate the heat level. Like, this to me, on a heat level from one to four is like a three. Hmm. I think that's. Like, I can tolerate with time, but it definitely hits me. It's hitting me too. <laughs> and you're Decently. a spicy kind of guy, you know, like, yeah. I'm kind of surprised. Let's see, I'll probably rate this value a 2 out of 4 on the spice scale. Oh, wow. You sure can tolerate that spice. Uh, 4 would be like, it's going to melt your tongue. Yeah. You know, 3, it, it, at least for me, anyway. Three right. is, I can tolerate a small amount of it, but it's going to eventually like burn me out. Two, I can <laughs> tolerate quite a bit of it. And one is no big deal. I don't think we're going to be rating any of these a one. Like mm -hmm. that one there alone is already giving me a three. This next one is called Carolina Reaper. And this is the one you're most scared of. I don't know why, but we'll find out. Mm -hmm. So we got Carolina Reaper here. You need cheers. Cheers, folks. Oh god. I'm actually kind of disappointed. Disappointing? That's the point. Like, <clears throat> I'm not playing with you guys. My tongue really feels like it's on fire. I can't take your bite of that. <sighs> like it feels like I'm breathing in and out fire. <laughs> oh my god. But that one, it was definitely a spicy kick. Yeah, it's um, starting to affect me too. It was definitely for spicy enthusiasts. So to me, that's a four. Solidly. That is just burning my mouth right now. Definitely a three for me. I mean, I can tolerate uh, it. Three? <laughs> Right, so this guy's got a high spice tolerance. I like to breathe out. Yeah. <sighs> I mean, I'd have to like practice some more with that. I might need some water. <laughs> this is definitely a, this be a nice challenge, guys, if you want to try some spicy food for 24 hours. It's like, <clears throat> oh my god. The trick with that one is it starts like not so bad, but then it's it get, it fires you up afterward. It's more subtle. It's like. Eat. Yeah, breathe in. <laughs> this is a lot of fun. <laughs> Not so much. All right, guys. This is the one I'm most scared of. Let's do ghost pepper. Why am I so shaky? Because I'm scared. Cheers, folks. One moment. Hmm. I'm trying to wait for it to hit. Hmm. That was actually not as bad as I thought. Like, this might actually be a two for me. Why is the ghost pepper one on the spicy? 
I'm trying to bite. It does have a little bit that has with it, but this is actually not as bad as that Carolina Reaper stuff. So you were right. The Carolina I Reaper stuff is like with the spiciest. This one is just like, it's definitely spicier than the habanero. I would actually tolerate that just a little bit. So to me, um, it's like a two and a half, two, two and a half, come on. I'll give it a three for this one, but no, maybe it's a two. I think it's more, <laughs> I'm just still affected from the previous one. That Reaper, don't play games. No, kind of Reaper stuff gonna leave you like wanting to drink a gallon of milk. That stuff does not play with you lightly. But like, you're not gonna be seeing me eat that. Like, first bite, and I, I still feel like I'm on fire even like minutes later. So, it's definitely not something to play lightly with, you know. Whew, but <laughs> Buggies, you outdid yourself with some spicy dang gun sauces. I'm impressed. Because mm -hmm. I don't usually see these at you know, stores around here, so. If you like really spicy stuff, then challenge yourself, go to Bucky's and get these. You will not be disappointed. Anyway, guys, that's all the time we have for today's review of Bucky's salsas. If you have a Bucky's in the area, go try them out. Tell us what you think below, and we're definitely very curious about it. Also, be sure to hit the red button below to subscribe and hit the bell to see notifications. And, and we'll see you in the next video. video. <laughs> this is Crystal and Charles. Signing out. Bye, Bye birdies. birdies.